Welcome to my final report on Tuesday the 22nd of December with me, Richard Perry, macro analyst at Handtech Markets. Looking at gold, and we've had this rebound in gold, haven't we? I started to sort of discuss in my uh, weekly outlook video yesterday um, the fact that gold was not necessarily selling off as much as it had been. Sorry, excuse me. <coughs> And it was beginning to start to improve, and that has certainly continued yesterday. Another strong green candle, and that was the first time we've seen that in a couple of weeks, really. And that was the reaction um, on the ECB at the earlier point in the month. And we're starting to see this move above all these, um, all these, mo all these rebounds in the last couple of weeks. Now we've closed at uh, one seventy-eight oh six, which is actually a two. Um, over a two-week high actually on gold in terms of a closing basis so that is that significant it could be that uh, gold is beginning to start to gain a bit of momentum look at these momentum indicators stochastics nicely improving on the stochastics RSI at a well the highest in almost two months on that RSI um, so it's interesting we're starting to get this bit of contract uh, bit of traction 108870 is that big uh, rebound resistance higher from the ECB is it that we're starting to see an improvement in sentiment while well, we're now into this overhead supply band 1077 to 1098 so that sort of now starts to think well maybe you need to look at um, how long it can stay in this band because obviously you've got the overhead supply in this band um, and uh, if it starts to be that gold can maintain a move in this band well that could again give the bulls some confidence so that is the key resistance 1088.70 if you if you saw a close above that then that up, I suppose completes your base pattern uh, double bottom base which actually would give you an implied move 45.85 up towards uh, 88.70 is to $43 on 88. So that's around about 130, isn't it? Uh, sorry, uh, 11.30 that you could give of, as upside. Um, so we could see a, a fairly reasonable uh, recovery if we do see this uh, completed base pattern. So 10.88.70 is your big level to watch out for, but certainly the bulls are beginning to sort of get a bit more of traction. We've broken out from the uh, from this downtrend channel, so that is important. You're seeing higher highs, you're seeing more positive momentum uh, on the hourly chart as well. So all these uh, all these different aspects are beginning to give the bulls confidence. You've got a rebound um, higher low on uh, on the hourly chart yesterday's reaction low at uh, 10.6660 nicely um, forming a, another higher low uh, which is probably your key support to now watch out for 10.6660 you need to hold on to that support but certainly the uh, bulls will be gaining in confidence on the back of uh, what's happened in the last couple of days so I wish you good luck in your training today and I'll speak to you again tomorrow thank you